all right my people welcome back onto this channel well this is another strong one reaching us it's a breaking news fuel subsidy so wolu announces 50 percent reduction on lagos buses all right i know a lot of people be like hmm, she ain't got time buying sunny she ain't got time buying sunny yeah well onto this one in a bid to help lagos resident cope with the effect of fuel subsidy removal governor babaji de son wolu has announced palliatives with effect from wednesday there will be a 50 percent reduction on lagos buses son wolu has also approved a 25 percent reduction in yellow buses fees which will be officially announced by their union well a tweet from the governor's media aide Jubril Gawat read flash. Governor of Lagos State, Mr. At Jide Sonwolu, has announced palliatives to caution the effect of the fuel subsidy removal. 50% reduction on Lagos buses from Wednesday. 25% reduction in yellow buses fee, which will be announced officially by their body. All right, and then this is what is actually reaching us. I know a lot of people be like, hmm, is that what we are telling them? Well, make on continue. All we know is that hey, this way, way, the whole thing they go, we are going our separate way. So, Yoruba nation, no going back. Well, under this one, according to Ogu Jeremiah, it says, you put your citizens into deep poverty and turn around to give them peanut. What a country what happens to school fees food and the rest okay that's another serious one yes when food is still expensive and the salary is not being increased when there is there is no good road where there is no when they have even increased the no school fees and the rest of them well my brother my sister a lot of things are still going to happen well you know i said it earlier that this one that they said they are going to give out some no palliatives to reduce the hardship which will last for about six months i always say this that that six months this is to tell you that the hardship will continue to six months hey hey my brother my sister no be small something no. you mean the people will now wait till another six months till six months before they will now get themselves or after six months they will continue to give them the palliative and the, the people we keep suffering right now my brother my sister nothing is actually working as far as the country is concerned nothing is work working at all and the, the people are fed up the people are tired hey this is so serious it's not fair at all well those jagaban supporters enter buses that your portion poverty we will buy fuel at any price okay this one is coming from Bl Bihanka, okay we will buy fuel at any price so okay that's serious so people are hungry they are not happy that no for according to what this person is saying that for the government to say oh they are giving out you no know, they were going to give us 50 percent reduction in fuel uh, in buses in transportation for only yellow buses anyway hmm, that this is a sign of poverty because by the time they are able to do this this is to tell you that hey you are going to remain you no know, in that same abject poverty for the next six months first that is the first phase my brother my sister i think the needful has to be done yoruba nation no going back the people have said it that as far as hey nigeria is concerned there is nothing like one nigeria there is no love if there is love in that country i tell you if there is love things are supposed you no know, to work out nothing is actually working people are dying on a daily basis on is killing a lot of people on a daily basis people are being kidnapped <laughs> my brother my sister it is not funny at all at all majority of people have reacted in different forms that huh, will this one help now hmm. why your government to why wednesday that strike is starting okay why wait till nlc come up with strike sure okay hmm. and that's another one now that the nlc have said 
unfailingly on wednesday strike will resume so they are not giving well that one even, this is a national thing but this one is only for lagos state in case you don't know okay oh my brother my sister not yellow bossy so hmm as he stopped the collection by agbero okay that's another one no because even agbero is extorting people like seriously people have been extorted and they're right now even the drivers are to you know just do justice to themselves and make themselves happy that's why you see the price going up okay now maybe they have to stop the activity of agbero well that is for them well what does the governor mean what does the governor means by lagos boss okay does he mean government brt buses okay let us understand okay i think that's another strong question from an anonymous person now, right now they are saying lagos buses okay commercial buses okay my brother my sister are you sure everybody will benefit from this that's exactly what the problem is people will not benefit from all this one no <laughs> the hardship is too much how long are we going to free how long are we going to be free from all this that's another serious one so madina poly says, well you reduce the price of your buses so those that use yellow buses to feed their family will now die of hunger hmm, that's serious peter Mba, are you saying this okay the useless governor of enogun state continue to pursue shadow okay that's another one well china 24 says well i like what is happening tribalism has killed nigeria let them enjoy tinumbu's government just two months nigeria become hell Unto for you people ha 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 hmm, that's serious and exactly what it is just two more to a lot of people are still hoping that oh it will be better well we are watching all fingers are being crossed but our prayer is that make people no congo die finish before they can realize the right thing to do this is serious hmm somebody actually talked about the fact that oh because they have heard that nlc is commencing their protest as from as from when is day so they are not trying to see what they can do if um, uh, it is too late man well uh, hmm, agbero collection should be banned also every money goes to the filling station now okay that's another one oh, okay very nice move oh. hmm, others should emulate okay somebody is saying okay it is all good at least to uh, to an extent they are starting from somewhere okay well hmm, but my brother my sister the hardship is too much we just have to tell ourselves the truth hmm. well somebody is of the opinion that hmm, this one is going to okay agbe recollection should be banned okay hmm. all right somebody somebody just you no know, says okay reply to that to t buga that okay if they stop the collection of agbe i think maybe uh -huh, to an extent things will still work out a little but my brother my sister how long are we going to continue like this hmm. how many people can actually survive this that's exactly what the problem is this is to tell you that the hardship continues hmm. but by god now your hand would there meanwhile yoruba nation no going back exactly what the people are talking about what more can we say meanwhile let me have your own take on this my people and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are just joining us on this channel for the first time all right thanks and god bless